Fear not, I'm coming. Hey guys, what's up, guys? It's Luigi Dragon here, aka Panzer Dragon, and today I'll be featuring Sinjar Jungle. Um, let's see, masteries. We go 21.90 of Risky getting a bunch of AP and runes. Oh, it's gonna be 15 AP with this, with the, what do you call it? With a dish of uh, magic penetration. Uh, I tried to make that. I tried to really make that uh, cheesy, but I forgot the words. I'm a bit sick, so I might cough a bit or. Snort? No, I probably won't snort. That's disgusting. Anyways, so Cinder Jungle, um, her clears lots of, uh, once you get the Spectral Wraith, her, she her bunch, has a bunch of AoE, so you kind of get mitigated spell vamp from all that. And, it's kind of, eh. It's kinda, but once she gets enough AP, her clears become a bit fast, and of course she's going to take all the blues because she'll need it, unless you get Chalice. But I do actually get Chalice this game anyways too. So as you can see, they're invading. And it looks like a three-man invade versus four. No, five. Well, three right here, but versus three. And there's a ward there. Okay, I see that. Okay, guess what? I'm going to ward here because I th feel like they're going to try and steal it. So if they're going to come in that way, I'm going to... I can see them do something. And of course, I'm going to drag the blue out if I decide to start it. Uh, as Lee Sin could just hop, pop over and get a Q, and if he lands a Q, that means that I'm gonna miss a smite. He's good. All right, so it looks like you can see they're invading, and you know what? I decide I'm ranged. I'm ranged, so if they want to poke this out, I can fight and win this. And it looks like we're gonna go. It looks like we're gonna go. Alright, so that looks like they're going to go on Karthus. No, it does look like they're going to get it. I don't think so, probably not. So I'm going to 2v1 here and just going to get some auto attacks in. Oh, poke. And of course, <clears throat> we're just going to try and poke them out. Unless we, until we catch them. So I see, uh, oh, Lee Sin's pretty low. Alright, I see that. And this means a lot of things. This means if he's low, I can get his, I can get his red for free. Now, see, so Siki, I'm going to auto attack and keep moving with her. And I force a flash out of that. So since Leeson is low, as you can see, as he's fucking hella low, that means a free red for me. But instead, it looks like we can get him. And <laughs> there's first blood for me. Uh, somehow. So you can see this is why he never invaded Syndra. Because she's really fun. She's just like that. I don't know. She's just she's just really good. Oh, hey, go. No, 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 no. Go back to fucking Syndra. Okay. So I get that, smite it, and I'm too low to probably even do um, my blue. So, oh, I see a gank going in here. I see a gank going here. So I'm just going to get a few auto attacks. And am I going to chase? Yeah, I do chase because I can see he's low. And I have red buff. And, I mean, dude, I saw he was low. No mana. There's no mana. I see Lee Sin Q. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm not going to chase that anymore. And I'm level two. He's level one. He's gonna try and duke, duke, duke me, attack me. I dodge. I predict his Q right away. I see it. And now he might die. And I should have got that auto, but I didn't. And because Leeson missed Q, he lost. He he would have killed me if he landed Q. But um, I do know Leeson's cooldowns. Um, I do kind of predict them, sort of. It's like up every nine seconds, and you just well, it's not really predicting. It's more like you gotta juke it. Um, you gotta juke it every once in a while. Um, what's that? Okay, so I do. Was it gonna cover mid? Yeah, I was gonna cover mid definitely, and get this farm. Uh, eh. Oh, didn't get the farm. So anyways, I see Trinity Wizard here. He's obviously going to get all three of these CS. I kind of stayed for this one. Uh, whatever. Let's go get it. Now it's time to finally actually start blue. As you can see, I do my QWE. And when I... What the hell? Go back here. Um, and once, um, once the golem comes near me, I do knock it away and try and stun it. As I don't want to take a, a lot of damage. Now you can see I am 1 in 1. Or 1 in 0 1. Why do I go mid? That's a good question. Wait. Oh, I think I saw a car at this back or something, so I'm just gonna push it or something. Oh, no, I remember now. It's because I wanted his blue. I really wanted his blue. I don't know how I. I, for, I honestly forgot how I knew his blue was still up. But. Oh, it's. I probably saw him on the minimap somewhere. 
So what I actually so that's why I want to shovel mid was because the reason I want to shovel mid was because I wanted our mid to come to their blue. So that's what I really wanted to, so we can get like an invade on the blue, and then he'd be deprived of his blue. But apparently Karth has blue. Oh wait, no, I think he stole that from me. Sorry. So um, that's what I really expected was uh. I meant to come and help help do blue, but I think I forgot. I told I for, I forgot to tell tell my blue mid <laughs> to come to their mid. I just kind of assumed that we'd come. Um, other than that, I think it's still up, but it's too late because I died, and which kind of sucks. So I started just doing my jungle and just get my buff. Alrighty, let's see what we're what, what I'm gonna do next. It looks like I'm trying to come up for mid. If he appears mid, I think I can kill him. So I'm gonna ward, yeah, so it's gone. So that means Lee Sin took it. Lee Sin's up here. And that means I'm either going probably not gonna do Super Wraith, because I don't have a, a lot of single target spells. So I'm gonna probably gonna do some counter jungling on his wolves. Because I see Lee was up here. This ward should protect me. And the least right there, because you can see the the um, fog of war bug. Okay, so Karthus is right here. I'm gonna see if I can try this, and it looks like we are. And I do land the stun. There you go. That stun is really hard to land. I don't even know how I land it. And as Trinomir is gonna go ham, Trinomir gonna go ham, and he gets the kill. Um, he would have lived if he pressed Q. He would have lived if he pressed Q, but he didn't press Q, so he sucks. Uh, that is my friend, so I can say whatever about him. Um, other than that, uh, that's basically your first Cinder gank, is you gotta land the stun. If you don't land the stun, it's a failed gank. And there I land the stun. I don't want to auto-attack him, um, because he will, he will, he can, he'll do more damage if he lands the Q on me. Um, if he does not land a Q on me, I can get some auto red procs on him in dueling. As you can see, here I am. I'm trying to hide behind minions uh, to dodge his Q, because that's his most powerful skill in the game. Alright, so, I have 16 CS, at least in this 14. Uh, oh, he also started Dorn's Ring, our blades, that's why I don't want to do him. As you can see, he has Spectral Wraith now, which is pretty big for uh, a girl like me. Here I come to help, and yeah, I'm just gonna probably duel him. Oh my God, did he actually live? No. And Karthus go ham. It's free kill for me, obviously. And here's my, and here it goes. I'm level six. I see that shit. So I just ult him because I had, yeah, I just ult him because I'm not gonna wait. I'm not gonna wait like um. For my cooldowns to be up so I can kill Lee Sin, I'm just gonna straight up ult him, and it's like on a 90 second cooldown, so I don't really have to worry too much. Alright, so I'm really low, and I almost died to Karthus while he was dead, I, I think I forgot, and I had to run through minions, it's pretty bad, but good thing I have uh, uh, 14 health regen, because that saved me. I think. Okay. So, now jungling with Syndra with this item is going to be easier because... No, that's weird. I heard a typing noise. Okay. Oh. That was really weird. What? It's working. Oh, what the hell? Oh. I think I said I was looking at something on Google Chrome. Okay, so I did close that. Anyways, uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I grabbed my blue. Oh, so I can see this is a dive, or an, I can get, I can burst someone definitely. And there it is. I land my stun and get everything. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> she would have died from the rocket if it hit. Anyways, even if she buried, I'm pretty sure it was pretty low for that. So I saw they were kind of low, and I definitely knew I could burst them. And uh, I missed my combo, the QE combo, or yeah, QE. So I'm just gonna zone him from getting any of that CS that's dying. And he jumps into me, so he's gonna die. And there's my auto attack. And there you go, so Sinja, 
that f at last gank with her ultimate was pretty pretty and there is the kill there is the kill <laughs> so Trindamir dies from super wraith he would have lived if he just pressed Q again like I said uh, but he doesn't L lol and so let me explain that gank again that was um that gank you have to that gank was actually mostly burst I guess you can say and I landed my full combo and uh, which allowed me and my teammates to follow up with ultimate or something you also want to press Q before you ultimate as you want a, 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 a lot of spheres on the field to um, do the damage four is enough probably I'll say four is definitely enough um, but I mean like as you poke more as the battle goes on more and as someone comes closer to you that's when you use your ultimate well not really you kinda use it when it to burst someone down so but the more spheres you get obviously the more damage it'll do I just I just I think I just use it on instinct to be honest so he goes on me and I do okay so Lee Sin goes on me and I'm gonna burst him straight up um, I see he's really, he's not really squishy, but I mean, I see he's kind of squishy. So I'm just going to use all my bursts on him because I know that Trindamir can get on him. So he can follow up and do the net, um, he could finish him off because Trindamir is a good chaser with this spinning E. Uh, so that's the, then I just go and burst on him because if I get near Karthus, he's going to, he's going to fuck me up. He's got a rod of ages. And I don't want to go on his AOE. I don't want to take his lay waste. Nope, nope, nope. Lee Sin does no damage. He's got two items. He's 0 6, so that's how you do it. And we go to we go to do uh, wraiths because I'm gonna try and get some mana. Is my smite up? No, I don't get any mana. Also, if you have spell vamp, you smite. Um, you do get uh, spirit drain or whatever it's called, that passive, to heal your mana. So if you have smite up, it's pretty good. So I'm gonna shove this out because Karthus went back. I'll help Trindamir shove it out, and I'm gonna go back now too. Oh yeah, so let's look at the skill door. I'm maxing out QE. As you can see, I was going blasting one, but I decide where the hell is my mana? So I'm going to get a chalice this game. Uh, not yet. What's my gold? No, no, I can I can buy, afford it. I should. I'm waiting for 100, 880. I think that's what it costs. Yeah, there you go. So I get the chalice. I'm going to go um, Athene's Holy on Grail. You need the cooldown reduction. You need the mana regen. Uh, even with blue buff. Even with blue. Bluff, you won't probably sustain um, a poke or something, and once that's gone, you will not sustain uh, your mana pool if you're poking. So I'm waiting here for some kind of gank, and somehow I try and get that. I actually do try and get that. So I'm just gonna go on. I, uh, to be honest, I don't think I think I should have saved my ulti for that. Oh. So he lives the queue. Oh, so Lee Sin did some weird shit. I don't know what he was trying to do. He flashed, ulted me for some reason. Um, so as you can see, I did my. I feel like I didn't need, need, necessarily need to do that ultimate. I should have probably done it earlier, at, if I even wanted to. But as you can see, I just um, I ulted her at like what 100 hit point. I feel like it was a waste, but I had no other cooldowns probably. So that's probably why I did that. I'm low, so I want to get the farm, and I do see my blue buff is up. I see my blue buff is up, and I do have chalice, so I can definitely get my mana, my mana on, and I can definitely do it because I have chalice, and that mana gen is pretty going pretty fast. How do I have eight kills? All right, is am I going for a gank on this? Yeah, yeah, I definitely know me and Jinx can kill this. See, uh, that, that, that's what happens when you miss. That's what happens when you miss Dark Sphere. So I see Lissandra's coming in. Did she? Does she even have alt? Why didn't she alt me? She should have alted me. I would have died, but I don't know why she didn't. There you go. There you go. There's my ulti burst. I did my full combo on her finally. And Trinity comes to Rome. This is obviously going to be a kill. Is it? Yeah, it's going to be kill. He ignited. And Trinity is going to probably get a triple kill. Why would? What? He shouldn't. Ignite would have killed her. Okay, whatever. So, what am I doing? 
Oh yeah, I think that's all pointless for me to come. I don't care. I know Jinimer can clean up, so I don't even need to be there. Instead, I'm, I'm like, I have I already got a home guard because I need to rush down mid. As you can see, there's a lot of creeps. I need to rush down mid fast, and I'm still working down through that uh, Chalice of Harmony or the Fiend's Holy Grail. Just gonna push it out because Jinimer's not here, and I want Karthus to lose a lot of CS. He's got teleport though, so. Am I gonna try and harass him? Yes, I definitely might. Watch, there it is. And I don't, I can't pick up that sphere. I threw it away too fast. So now he's gonna die. And while wow, he lives, just kidding, he doesn't die at all. And now I'm just gonna try and poke him down as Cinder's range is actually really long. The Q and W gets long, and he's gonna try and kill us, try and one v two us. Uh, he cannot, because we've got a bit too much poke. I missed my, miss my poke combo. Just trying to poke him down. Look how much dark spheres I have. My ult's coming up in 30 seconds. And he missed trying to just, just kind of kite him a bit. I don't want to get a melee him. And now he can't go this way or I'll kick his ass. So now this, this middle tower is going to fall because, well, he got poked out and he can't come this way anyways. But I don't think Lee Sin has a bunch of wave clear, so that's also why. Anyways, I do not have blue buff anymore, and my my ulti just is about to come up. But I don't have blue buff, and I don't have a lot of mana. I need to get in Dean's Holy Grail to increase my mana. Gen. And so I'm just gonna do jungle because I need the I need the mana regen from it. Or do I? Well, I just wanted some farm. Anyways, I, I probably had conservative stacks. I'm just gonna do these wolves and. Uh, I think I see has yeah, some 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 fun stuff bought. Me and Trindamir want that. Oh, now they they stay they stayed. Yeah, now me and Trindamir want that. They should have backed away. Maybe they didn't have wards. I don't know. So I do and you see I land both my stuns, and I do alt vein, and now he's gonna die. And now wait, Trindamir had no ulti. Oh, he probably ulted earlier. So it is. This is where I'm gonna kill Lee Sin again. I'm just gonna kite him through minions and. Uh, he flash kicks me for some reason, and oh my god, look at this! Every I miss also a lot of skill shots. I'm not ever gonna come in melee range with him. I'm never gonna come in melee range with him. I'm just gonna keep trying kiting him with. There's no point in me going melee range. I don't want him to auto attack me. I'm scared of his auto attacks. Even though he's zero and eight, I am still scared of his auto attacks. I'm not gonna be stupid about it. About dueling him, I'm gonna be smart about it. Besides, it's, really, it's for some reason really hard. So my ult's back up, and I'm gonna kick her ass. So she tried to she eat me. I think she's trying to just go for her ass. Um, and really, there's no point in harassing me if with your E, especially getting in melee range. If you're support, Lissandra, there's no point. Um, you would just want a wave clear. That's so you should have just done QE on the waves in that situation. If you're Lissandra, you don't, and you don't want to teleport in close range to me. I still have mad at the burst here. I'm just gonna grab this. I'm just gonna grab this blue. I'm probably gonna try and solo dragon, and it's not working out that well. It's just really horrible at dragon. As you think, big. Ch I took a big chunk, and I see veins here. And oh, I don't think I want to get really that close in range. Yeah. So I thought that ulti would kill her, but she actually barriered, so it's kind of sucky. And I see. Alessandro was chasing me, but yeah. So I did want to. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, this is where I get outplayed. This is where I get outplayed. Um, I could have honestly killed her. Let's. Re uh, I want to rewind that. I don't think. I think this is kind of important. I'll go over it. Okay. So she comes in. She comes in. Okay, I missed my EQ. I missed my EQ. That was really important. I would have killed her if I even. Just didn't even have E, or sorry, if I would have killed her if I just didn't miss the E, and because it would just done damage, and I'm pretty sure she would have died. And what? How much damage does it do? Okay, you can't see it, but yeah, that I, as you can see, that's where I screw up. I could have killed her, but I fucked up because she didn't E. I thought she would E sooner for some reason. Uh, I don't know why. And yeah, I would have killed her, but I fucked up. Uh, he's trying to invade me again. So I do have cap. Oh my god. Now a bunch of people are coming at me for some reason. 
Oh, I have ult? Aw, oh, that's sad. I would have killed him if I ulted. Uh, what else am I supposed to go over? I am probably going to do a Void Staff. Okay, so, um... It was a, I was supposed to go something over something else. I forgot what it was. But, um... I'm basically, like, mid singer right now. I got a lot. It's at 13 kills. Uh, I'm just going to probably do my red. I don't really care if red. Jinx wants it. Actually, I really do. I did give it to him. Let's see. So, Mundo's kind of... What is he? He's got a lot of hit items hit point. I can maybe... Oh, I can burst him. He's got 2,700. I'm really far ahead. And I missed my combo. God damn it. Miss again. Is he going to get it? Where's the chicken? 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 And I did get it. Oh, see, my ultimate didn't do that much damage. I need Void Staff to kick his ass. Look at this. I missed all my shit. See, I'm just going to kite it out right here. I'm not taking any... I'm going to be in the back line. I'm, i got to avoid Karthus uh, Defile. It's annoying. And now where am I? Here I am. I, don't, I thought she was going to go on me. Oh my god. I actually have to look at this myself. What more my what cooldowns are up? Let's see. So I'm sure I think I did Wraith just to get some hit point back in. And here she is. And there I miss I think I missed yeah, I did definitely did miss my E. My W was up, but I was too scared that she would go on me. So I could have threw my W at her, but I fucked up. As you can see, I'm not the best passenger player, but I mean, I, I do get kills somehow. I get I get kills somehow, and I don't know how. Um, I'm working towards that void staff still. What the hell is this directed camera? I'm gonna do my blue. I'm gonna guess grab my blue and farm up. I'm probably we're five man now, so it looks like we're probably gonna try and fight something. So I'm just gonna poke it out, try and catch someone with my E, and I see he gets in range of my ulti, so I'm just gonna kill him because I know I can kill with my ulti. Because my ulti is really powerful. So, like I said, I'm just gonna try and poke it out. And um, once I catch someone with my stun, that's when the that's when the team fight goes. Or someone gets CC. There, there's the team fight. There's the team fight. So I'm just gonna try and kill him. Um, you're gonna want to disengage after you kill Karthus because he makes a zone that you cannot pass through. And now we're just gonna push down mid. Still, I have blue buff. I have a lot of poke. So yeah, we're just gonna hit it because we're gonna get some damage on it. There it come. There's Mundo. There's Mundo. And oh my god, lots of kills. Well, lots of kills. The only way I can reach him is with my E Q E combo. Still trying to poke this out. And he, there he is. He comes in range again for my ulti. So I see that this is a really good easy kill. And I can easily get that. There is the stun. There's the stun, but he is on ulti mode. And we're just gonna probably hunt this down. Push, push, push. We're just gonna push. And we're gonna get. Just still again. Poking. Not going on the back line. Going around the front line. Trying to burst the poke. Front line. Or now it's Karthus I want. Or no, sorry. It's the Lissandra because he went on Ezreal. And I want to protect Ezreal. And there's our vein. She gets in. She tries to flank us for some reason. I don't know. And it looks like we're, we're still trying to poke and disengage. And there's a stun. There, she's dead. She's got to be dead. Now I'm going to try and disengage from this. And... Ooh, 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 ooh. You never stood a chance. And... Oh, man. And, oh, man. So, I tried to kill Leeson again with my ultimate. Uh, just, just, <laughs> just because I, if I did it two times in a row, that's what I wanted his third death to be. So I did flash it and got pretty greedy for that. It was a risky move because I didn't even, I don't think he even landed my QE combo. Yeah, I didn't stun him first. I grabbed their blue because it's, it's, it's not, it's not sieging time anymore because like, oh, we're kind of low. So we just back up and do whatever. Okay, so I'm going for a poke on this again. Uh, but not getting too close because I don't think I landed my bur uh, stun on that. And again, pushing out the mid. Um, you see, they're all here. 
I don't care. I like towers. There's four here. I don't care. I like towers. And also, no one can 1v1 me. I have 16 kills. I've got a lot of bursts. I can one-shot someone. Um, and I can kite someone. Oh, so here it is. And I would have probably killed him, but... I would have killed him if I landed, like, something. But as you can see, or if he didn't zone, he has that ulti. But as you can see, no one can 1v1 me. And, holy shit. I'm not in range. I, th I could have, actually, I was scared. I don't know why I was scared. I could have got grabbed the kill. I could have grabbed the kill, to be honest. But, with my WQ, because I did see those two were up. Those two were definitely up. And he's stunned. He's stunned. Is no one going on there? No. He's stunned. Uh, at least I forced a flash. Whatever. Okay. Oh shit, so I'm probably gonna die. Oh, no. Good disengage by me. I'm low hit point, but that means I'm still vulnerable. I'm gonna kill Lissandra. And I do get my combo on her. Oh man. But as you can see, I'm really scared of going like even range. So I'll just die though. Because uh, I got the CC from uh, the wall. I got slowed, so I don't care. Uh, but as you can see, like I just keep try and keep kiting. I'm scared to get in there to even use my W though, as I feel like Vayne could like kick my ass or something. So I try and still still stay my distance away from her. All right, so speed this up, and there we get the inhibitor. And I don't remember. I don't prioritize um, Baron and Hermos that much, unless we're losing. Then I'll prioritize it. Oh my god! Wait, did I just skip a bunch of shit? As I was yabbering on, oh man. Okay. Alright. So, I got my void staff. What's going on? I think I just broke it. Oh my god. Oh, uh, I think I just broke it. Fuck. Okay, fuck it. We'll just skip it to live. I'm sorry. Whatever. Alright, so I did. I guess I came back and there was a team fight. And now I see Mundo's gonna go on me. I'm gonna try and juke his cleavers. I have to juke his cleavers. And I'm here to see if I can push him back. And I did Zonia's because I don't want none of that. So I had to push him back with my E. And this is Cinder Jungle. You don't ever want to do it because she is a better mid laner, and as Jungle, you won't get as that fed. You need a lot of kills to be doing that good and be considered an AP carry somewhat. Anyways, that's Cinder Jungle. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Um, sorry about that uh, little little bug I had with LO replay, but um. Uh, it was one team fight. I bet it was important. Nah, it wasn't that important. But anyways, thank you for watching.